technology and livelihood education, handicraft, exploratory course for grade 7 and 8. Handicraft Exploratory Course for Grade 7 and 8, Lesson 2.1. Our topic is Understand Recycling. Recycling is the process of transforming items which already serve its original purpose, but it's still durable and which can still change into something that can be used for another purpose. It is a good answer to the worsening problem of garbage disposal. Instead of throwing away the scraps we have at home and totally waste them, we can be more imaginative, creative, and resourceful person by seeing potential in waste materials. There is truth in saying that there is a cash in trash. All we need is a little entrepreneurial skill and a lot of concern for environment. There are vast materials that are locally available in your community which can recycle into useful and artistic articles for personal and home use. Types of Recycling there are two types of recycling, the internal recycling and the external recycling. Internal recycling involves the use of materials that are waste product of manufacturing process. An example of this is the processing of spent grain mash, a waste product of distillation, into a cattle feeds. External recycling is the reclaiming of materials from a product that has been worked out due to constant use. A good example of this is the conversion of old newspaper and magazines into another paper products. Advantages of Recycling First, it minimizes pollution and protects the environment from the pollution. Second, it conserves resources. Third, it enhances creativity and resourcefulness. Fourth, potential in making a profitable business. Number five, it makes people environmentally aware. Number six, it promotes scientific advancements in recyclable and biodegradable materials. And number seven, it makes governments and business to choose programs and apply policies in consideration of preserving and respecting the environment. It is important that we should know how to manage our waste. Waste management is the proper disposal and recycling of trash. If you notice, recycling has a great impact to the environment because of its role of converting the old items into new goods. It is also a help of the environment to achieve a healthy living earth. Two forms of recycling. First is the biodegradable waste. It is the process of composting any decomposable waste or trash such as food waste, which is a form of recycling. Second is the non-biodegradable waste. Are recyclable resources like glass, paper, metal, plastic, textile, including electronics and batteries. How can the old item becomes new? That would be our lesson for today. But before that, you should identify first the materials to be used in recycling. The following are the materials used in recycling. First is the paper. It is a substance made from wood or other fibrous materials, usually used in writing, printing, and wrapping. Papers are also known as biodegradable waste for composting. It can be recycled as paper woven basket, paper mache articles, paper beads, paper sculpture, boxes for gift wrapping, album covers, and paper bags. Second is the plastic. 
plastic products includes beverage bottles and containers commonly used for liquid goods and body care products. It can be recycled as planters, plant tags, plastic sculptures, and organizers. Next is the glass. Glass is one of the easiest materials to recycle because it can easily be crushed and ready to be melted cold colored. It can be recycled to decanter, storage items, terrariums, cut bottles, bent bottles, and glass tiles. Next is the fabric scrap. It is any cloth or good produced by weaving, knitting, quilting, and patchwork projects. Rugs, runners of hand-stitched circles of fabrics, staff toys, hair accessories, fabric flowers, and collages. Next is the metal. Example of metal is food or drink cans made from aluminum and steel. It can be recycled as canister, storage bins, planters, baking tins, candle holders, kerosene lamps, metal art, and water catchers. Make sure to use aluminum foil to clean the cans. To achieve a creative project and finish it successfully, you must remember to observe good working habit at your workplace. First is to prepare and organize all needed tools and materials. Second, to avoid accident, make sure to tie your hair before working. Third, use appropriate tools and materials in your project. Number four, use scissors in cutting and not your teeth. Five, put your scraps in a plastic bag or in a trash bin. Number six, work with your hands and not with your lips. Number seven, follow the step-by-step -step procedure. And number eight, clean your working area before leaving the room. There are a lot of waste materials that can be recycled in other cities as well as in many rural areas. Paper is one of the most abundant and available waste materials. It comes in many forms like old newspapers and magazines, boxes, wrapping paper, office waste, old telephone directories, and the likes. Next is the plastic container would come in second and tin cans in third. Used clothing is also abundant. Also considered recyclable are glass bottles. Manufacturing waste like yarns and fabric scraps are also high usable materials. The following table are the list of the articles that are made from these recyclable materials. First is the paper. It can be transformed into paper woven basket, paper mache articles, paper beads, paper sculpture, boxes for gift wrapping, album covers, and paper bags. Next is the plastic container. It can be planters, plant tags, plastic sculpture, and organizers. Glass bottles. It can be used as decanter, storage items for terrariums, cut bottles, bent bottles, and glass tiles. Fabric scrap, quilting and patchwork projects, rugs, runners of hand-stitched circles of fabrics, staff toys, hair accessories, fabric flowers, and collages. Next is the yarn waste, rugs, tapes, trees, embroidery, yarn dolls, crochet or knitted articles, and string art. Tin cans. It can be converted as canisters, storage bins, planters, baking tins, candle holders, kerosene lamps, metal art, and water catchers. A time to remember. Let's recycle. Look around your home. Take note of the things that are normally thrown away 
or dispose of after they have been used for their original purpose. Think of the articles into which an item can be converted or recycled. Then complete the table below. Example has been provided to guide you. List down at least 10. List down the articles that can easily be made out of the following recyclable materials. This is Mylene Huliganga. Thank you for watching.